What to do if I have two guitars which are not really good? One person asked me this question today and here is the answer because he find out that the drilling of the walls of his bridge are uneven and of course having such big flaws of measurements if a luthier cannot drill six damn walls straight they want to speak of tuning obviously the guitar will not tune well because to place the frets you need topmost accuracy so I understand that and I know what, what it is because I, I see my experience with at present I have around 90 students and some of them also accidentally acquire bad guitars doesn't matter if they are expensive, careful, here there is one thing we can get an inexpensive nice guitar and an inexpensive bad guitar or an uh, expensive nice guitar or expensive bad guitar which is the case of this person probably and then of course it's uncomfortable to find out that to me it's a disrespect that the luthier gives a bridge wrong calculated I will post the description of this video a video in which I explained at length what I mean with that but anyway the thing is that if you are playing because of course he's playing for fun and he wants to have fun playing just like me and like you and most of my students they play for fun, I also play for fun and which fun is there playing a guitar which does not tune well I understand that and therefore you can always sell those bad instruments and get a real simple inexpensive but proper guitar this is the, because some guys have also three or four and you cannot make one out of, of them so this is just easy solution is just sell those pieces there and, and get a nice instrument because otherwise whatever you practice on instruments which are not proper it will condition you that way and you get also habituated to suppose if if you are 20 years or 10 years playing a guitar which doesn't tune then now you don't know what is tuning what is not tuning you are used to guitar that does not tune well so all these things measurements and it's also same thing and actually this is not a big problem because you can solve it getting a proper guitar this is the only solution and yeah of course we want to play for fun but fun is there it depends uh, of course it's a personal thing in the sense that it depends up to which level you want to enjoy your playing right so if you understand what is the at the stake here with this tuning tuning aspect uh, flaws on the bridge etc then just get rid of those guitars and get a good one un amigo que descubrí ahí el, la improvisación la improvisación es algo que yo pienso que cada músico debería cada músico del estilo que sea del clásico del flamenco de cualquier otra música debería debería aprender porque en la improvisación te da mucha libertad y a la vez te da mucho conocimiento de de dónde estás tocando y cómo estás tocando de qué armonías están en cada momento ¿no? Pablo Paco, ¿qué es para usted la música popular y qué es la música elitista? Yo creo que la música elitista es el refinamiento de la música popular por ejemplo, el flamenco el flamenco originalmente es una música popular la música del pueblo de Andalucía pero creo que ya no le pertenece más al pueblo, porque de pronto habemos gente que nos hemos pasado toda una vida encerrados, puliendo esa expresión popular. Entonces ha llegado a un nivel en el que, en el, que el pueblo ya no, no, no tiene acceso, sobre todo a los matices que vamos consiguiendo la gente como yo, que nos pasamos muchas horas elaborando esa música. 